Have you ever wondered why we fall in love? It's not just the sweet nothings and romantic gestures. There's an actual science behind it. Welcome to Science One, where we simplify science for everyone. The process starts in our brain, more specifically in the ventromedial prefrontal cortex. This part actually deactivates when we fall for someone, which is why love is often described as blind. Our brain is literally overlooking flaws and red flags. Next, our body releases hormones like oxytocin and dopamine. Oxytocin, also known as the love hormone, helps to build trust and bond with the person. Dopamine, on the other hand, triggers an intense rush of pleasure, similar to the high from drugs. Attraction and love aren't just about personality and interests. Genetics plays a key role too. Major histocompatibility complex, or MHC genes, which are involved in immune system regulation, are thought to influence mate choice. Research also suggests that proximity can impact who we fall for. The mere exposure effect states that people develop a preference for things simply because they are familiar. This is probably why we often fall for those who are close to us. Physical attraction can't be ignored either. Certain symmetry and proportion in a person's face, linked to genetic health, often appeal to us. This evolutionary perspective suggests that beauty is not just skin deep. Love is not just a feeling. It's a complex interplay of brain chemistry, genetics, and environment. It's what makes life beautiful and worth living. But remember, there's a fine line between love and obsession and it's important to maintain balance. We hope this has given you a deeper understanding of the science behind love. Whether you're a hopeless romantic or a curious scientist, we hope you found it fascinating. At Science One, we're all about making science simple and accessible. If you want to learn more about the world around you in a fun and engaging way, be sure to subscribe to Science One and turn on notifications. Thanks for watching and remember, keep questioning, keep exploring, and most importantly, keep falling in love. Because now you know, it's all scientific.